The following is a presentation of TFNN. Time to talk about your health. Living a primal lifestyle. We have Mike from Chicago on the line, and he has a question about digestion. Hi, Mike. Hey, guys. Happy Friday. Happy, Happy Friday. Friday. First of all, I just wanted to say that I love the show. I think it's uh, it's great programming, and I'm very much of a like mind when it comes to you know taking control of your own health and certainly doing your own research. Call now, toll free at one eight seven seven nine two seven six six four eight internationally at seven two seven four four five one zero four four. Now your hosts, Nico DeHaan and Paige Clark. Happy Friday and welcome to Living a Primal Lifestyle, where we analyze and deconstruct the latest news pertaining to your health, fitness, and diet, where we break down what we hear and what we see and see if it makes sense to us. And we encourage your participation by calling 877-927-6648. I'm Nico DeHaan. And I'm Paige Clark. And it's a beautiful day here in downtown Clearwater. It's 88 degrees and sunny, and it's been uh, warm. Uh, we've had a week of uh, probably some of the highest temperatures this year, and I think uh, the whole country is pretty warm, too. Yeah, just in time to go back to school. Yes, it is time and to get go in back that to AC. School, no doubt. <laughs> yeah, AC is a, uh, you know, what did we do before AC? I don't know. And I was really excited that, um, you know, you mentioned that you wanted to talk a little bit about education, you know, because this is really appropriate. Everybody's coming. Kind of headed back. I know our kids, our public school kids, went back last week. Yeah, you know, there was uh, some interesting articles. Uh, you know, uh, education. We're not really the leaders in education, and uh, for, I think for kind of like medicine and health. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of the same, isn't it? Uh, mm -hmm. uh, Finland is the country right now that's number one in education, and uh, they do things quite a bit differently there. So I, I kind of wanted to really talk about that. Let me just... And while you're getting that together, I'll just kind of uh, highlight a few points. You know, they've been, Finland has been hailed for exemplifying the ideal model of thriving, innovative education system that prioritizes the most important stakeholder, and that is the students. And I like that. Yeah. And uh, so maybe, maybe you can kind of share with us some of the things that actually make the Finland schools, uh, you know, so worthy of our attention, and maybe, you know, we should emulate them. Well, possibly. You know, there, there are no private schools in Finland. Uh, mm -hmm. there, all the administrators have worked as teachers before. I think that's important. They really don't focus on tests. Now, that's wonderful, because I think what's kind of happened in this country, you know, we see a lot of this standardized testing. Uh, again, it's like fitting a mold. It fits that concept of indoctrination. You yeah, instead me. of the child uh, letting that child express themselves, letting the human being express, per, express their uniqueness, uh, we actually want to fit them in that little mold, and mm -hmm. that's what it's all about. We, uh, we criticize people who are different. Mm -hmm. uh, when uh, the difference is really what should be celebrated, I believe. Uh, teaching is also uh, revered, uh, revered as a profession, just like a doctor is there. Mm -hmm. Here, we don't pay them a lot, but over there, they get a, they get a much better... Uh, and payment is not really what drives people. I mean, it's nice to be paid well for what you do, but, uh, you know... Well, I'm, the, the whole society there in Finland... Uh, you know, looks up to the teachers as very important for their future, yeah. and it looks like most of them have master's degree education, and um, and they typically have a you know a time period of which they're interning and this kind of a thing. So yeah. this produces a high quality teacher that's well paid. Yes, and, and uh, uh, the people there, the population trusts the teachers. Mm -hmm. So there's a very high regard. And we kind of have a little different uh, opinion of that. We really don't trust our teachers as much. Uh, we maybe trust certain ones mm -hmm. uh, as individuals, but as a whole, not so much. We don't pay them very well. We pay them pretty much what the average person makes here in the United States. Mm -hmm. And if we want, uh, if we th believe that education is important, uh, we really need to up our game a little bit as far as paying these people who are, uh, you know, uh, entrusted with the, not only uh, the education but the safety and the moral fiber that is part of our society. Yeah, exactly. And that, you know, one of the things that was interesting is mm -hmm. it says that one of the last factors that we had in this article was they integrate foreign students, but instead of doing like what we do, where we create these cool classes. Uh, 
uh, called, you know, English as a Second Language and so forth. They actually try to instruct these uh, immigrants and these other people from other cultures uh, to learn and express themselves in their native tongue. I thought that was very interesting. Yeah, I think language is important. Uh, well, some of the things that uh, we revere as really important, like reading, we want to start the kids reading very early, mm -hmm. is, uh, you know, really probably not the best way to go. Uh, I think what we need to stress here and what I really enjoyed about my childhood is there was a lot of play involved. Mm -hmm. uh, play, uh, get your imagination going. Uh, today play is a lot different because we have the TV and we have all these interactive things that we think is so cool, but it's much different than the three-dimensional real world is. Mm -hmm. I remember uh, playing in my room as an eight or ten year old with just marbles right and marbles all these different colors I have the good guys the bad guys to be Indians and cowboys and I could play with these marbles for hours I and know. hours I because marbles too. yeah that's cool yeah. we would have been really pals yeah. there, you know. just like that. <laughs> exactly <laughs> so I, I think that's so important and you know uh, in Finland one of the things is an hour and a half a day is uh, put aside just for play mm -hmm and also constructive play. In other words, they give their children blocks of uh, even unpainted little blocks and little toys that aren't really the prettiest things uh, and let the imagination take over. And I think that is the, the real important part. One of these uh, things I wanted to share, here's a quote from the article, you know one big difference in thinking about education and the whole discourse is that in the U.S. it's based on a belief in competition. Uh, in this country, in Finland, we are in education because we believe in cooperation and sharing. Cooperation is a core starting point for growth. And, you yeah. know, you and I have talked about that. That really, that's what's going to change the world. Yes. It's when we when we look at issues and problems, not from a competitive standpoint, but in, in from a collaborative standpoint. And I think that's that's going to be huge. Very important, Paige. Uh, you know, some of the things that we stress here is competition. And even if you're uh, playing, you're in competition with somebody in the tennis court and the mm -hmm. basketball court or whatever. Uh, one of the things that I love about jiu-jitsu, not only does it allow me to continue my play, mm -hmm. right. you know, rolling on the ground, mm -hmm. fighting with your buddy, uh, trying to outdo somebody, but you're not trying to kill that person even though it mimics that I mean, when you choke somebody out, you know, of course, there's the tap to stop the whole thing. But actually, you're killing that person. You're breaking that person's arm. You stop just short of it. So, I mean, it's powerful, yet it, there's respect there. Because if somebody does that to me, I shake their hands. Man, that was awesome. How did you do that? I want to learn more. Mm -hmm. You're going to better yourself. It's not, boy, I beat you. Right. It's a whole different ball game, and we really stress the winning in this country. Winning is the most important thing. It's mm -hmm. just like the money part is the most important thing. We got to get off that. And I think the the idea of creating experiential learning is important. I think that's why we see some of these. Uh, again that word alternative uh, alternative teaching like the Montessori's or mm -hmm. or, or the. Um, um, Gosh, what's it called? Because of the W. Anyways. Um, the Waldorf. Yeah, Waldorf School. Um, I mean, these are encouraging uh, creative type of thinking. And in Florida, and I have some friends that are raising their children, what they call their, their there are parents that have conventions, and it's called the unschoolers. Oh, awesome. I mean, they, their kids don't go to school at all. And it's about experiences, and they allow their kids to kind of use technology. It'll be mm -hmm. interesting to see how these all tie together. Um, but I definitely think it's time that we start looking yeah. at alternatives and look at some of these countries that are having such high um, performance in their young people. And we, we, we need to be willing to change and adapt to, to bring yeah, things I, that I are Yeah, I think one of the powerful. best options we have in the United States is homeschooling. Uh, my son is kind of homeschooled yeah. because uh, his dad moved across the country uh, to California. So we, we've we used a resource that helps him with his academics. But mm -hmm. then he's had flexibility schedule. And then he's been able to take some trips. So I think that there's... Uh, real power in helping the student become his own educator, too. Yeah. And I have found that uh, as a result of this, we've seen some great improvement in reading comprehension, and he chooses to read things. Some people may or may not agree, but what I love is it's changed his desire Well, he's doing reading. his own research. He's doing his own and research. And this brings up a point, because I was discussing this with Eduardo de Lima, my uh -huh. professor at Jiu-Jitsu, and uh, he was saying that uh, he was reading an article uh, of this Finnish high school teacher. 
Uh -huh. And uh, what the high school teacher did, he says, okay, I want everybody to bring in a news item uh -huh. from whatever source. Here we have uh, CNBC and we have Fox News. And, of course, if you listen to the same type of news with those, you'll find different slants on those as if there's only two slants. You or know? sometimes you'll hear the same slant. All or, over. Exactly. So, uh -huh. But uh, he, so when, he brought, when these people brought this, uh, these articles in or these news uh, audio recordings or video it might it may have been uh, he said okay now I want you to investigate and see where this story came from and what's the real meaning behind it because here we have two conflicting uh, views of it I want you to come up with your own view and what do you what you think about it so he was making these kids investigate so this prompts them to start investigating everything and that's exactly what that article told us there's no curriculum Right. For these Finland teachers. Yeah. They design their own curriculum. They, they, they trust these educators to be professionals yeah. and use a teaching skill that encourages that kind of... Yeah. And some of the, the best uh, educations, too, like the Waldorf and the Sudbury schools, mm -hmm. are having the children the educate themselves right. and the teachers kind of supervise mm -hmm. and I think that's so important because then and also they don't uh, uh, they don't pigeonhole the kids what they do is okay well, what's your passion what do you want to do mm -hmm. if they switch well now I'm interested in this fine go go find that and go find it on your own and then share share what you find exactly. with us uh, it's funny when I think back I went to the University of Florida mm -hmm. and a uh, big school Right. and uh, had a great education, I, I think, and, and I enjoyed it very much. It's funny that, you know, it's been years. I mean, I don't even want to say how many years, but it's been years. But when I think back, I can hardly remember a handful of professors' names. But one that I remember was, you know, my, my undergraduate history class, American history class, Dr. Julian Pleasance, because we went there. I would never miss his class because it was lecture, yeah. and our tests were never multiple choice. It was right. all essay, right. and it, it was always we had to, to explain something, but we had to give what we thought was the significance of it. Right. What was the significance of the War of eighteen twelve? You know, why? You know, tell me why this is important and how it's impacted us. And I. I really liked that. Yeah, you know, I, I did a lot of education up to uh, senior in high school in mm -hmm. Canada. Uh -huh. And when I came to the United States, I had to take a few high school classes just to uh, qualify me for to get mm -hmm. a university here. But uh, it astounded me that I got true and false and multiple choice questions in my senior year in high mm -hmm. school. And even uh, throughout college, a lot of it was that. Mm -hmm. And we're in Canada. I don't know what it's like now, but we everything was essay. Mm -hmm. Everything was essay. Even math was essay in a form mm -hmm. because you had to explain every so move you, you made. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think that's so important because that makes you think, it makes you express yourself, and it teaches you how to write at the same time, which was as important to me because I wanted to be a writer. You know, if you stop and think about it, today's kids, you know, cursive was a, something that we all learned, but they say that kids today don't even know that anymore. Yeah, and they don't even know how to print it. Uh, that's too much. good or not. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. They just type. Number here is 877-927-6648. Please pick up my health signals newsletter. I have a uh, one that's uh, out from last week. And, uh, good stuff. Yeah, it's good stuff, so you need to uh, take a look at that. Uh, we'll be back in a couple minutes. Nick, go ahead, Paige. You've heard Nico DeHaan as co-host of Living a Primal Lifestyle, which airs every Friday at noon Eastern Time on TFNN, and would like to tell you about the personal training studio that Nico is the owner and president of, Performance Training. Since 1998, Nico has trained individuals and groups to improve their health both mentally and physically. As a certified personal trainer, Nico's main focus is on demonstrating exercises correctly to avoid injury and teaching his clients how to manage their past injuries while getting getting the most out of their personal training sessions. The Performance Training Studio is filled with unique training equipment that enhances balanced results at a faster rate while minimizing damage and discomfort. For more information, you can give Nico a call at 727-418-8740 or email him at nico at tfnn.com. Let him know you heard him on TFNN and save up to $100 on a special package just for TFNN listeners. Act today. 
we've just launched one of our best Tiger Dollar sales ever. Right now, you can get a 40% bonus on any Tiger Dollar purchase through Sunday, August 24th. That's right, a 40% bonus. If you're a current subscriber, then this might be the easiest 40% you can make all year. And if you're thinking about subscribing, then get your Tiger Dollars now with a 40% bonus. They never expire and can be used for any TFNN product or service. For all the details, visit TFNN.com and lock in your 40% Tiger Dollar bonus today. Andy Heck's powerful weekly newsletter, The Technomental Commodity Report, has delivered multiple triple-digit winning trades in recent months. And right now's the perfect time to get a full month long trial to Andy's newsletter with no obligation to pay anything. Andy publishes his weekly newsletter every Thursday morning where he breaks down the commodity market and provides his subscribers with specific trading recommendations based on his trading methodology. By signing up for a free trial to the Technomental Commodity Report, you'll get a full 30 days to try out this powerful newsletter service and see for yourself the types of trades Andy has recommended for his subscribers. When you sign up for a 30-day free trial, you're under no obligation to pay anything. And should you decide to continue, you'll lock in the low rate of only $59 a month. Sign up right now for the Technomental Commodity Report and make sure you're ready to catch the next big trade in commodities. For more information and to get started today, visit the front page of TFNN.com. You take a hands-on approach to managing your investments, and whether you're bullish or bearish on Chinese stocks, the ETFs from Direction Shares are there to help you magnify your perspective. Bull ETFs for a rising market and bear ETFs for a falling market. Direction Shares gives you the tools for both sides of the trade. Discover how we can help at DirectionShares.com today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the Direction Shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction Shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact Direction Shares at 800-851-0511. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors such as traders and active investors employing dynamic strategies. Investors in the fund should understand the consequences of seeking daily investment results, understand the risk of shorting, and intend to actively monitor and manage their investments. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. Many of our new listeners have heard about The Tiger's Den, but wondered, what exactly is it? The Tiger's Den is a lively community where professional traders and investors can meet, exchange ideas and information, and a comfortable, moderated atmosphere. Hear all of your favorite TFNN shows, plus see all the charts as they happen, live, during those shows, and have access to all those charts. You can test drive The Tiger's Den absolutely free for 30 days. It will greatly enrich your knowledge of these markets. Details on The Tiger's Den are on the front page of TFNN.com. Nico and Paige take your phone calls now. now. Toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-445-1044. Welcome back, everybody. And uh, I'm Paige Clark. This is Nico DeHaan. Yep. How in the world did pharmaceuticals come to be the fourth leading cause of death in America? It's amazing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Well, let me tell you something, guys. You know, um, there's an article that uh, I found in Collective Evolution, and it really hit home for me. Uh, and I wanted to share it with people that I love, and I love you guys, so we want to go over it. Um, you know, there's a class of pharmaceutical drugs, drugs specifically, that I have a real concern about, and they're called fluoroquinolones. Hey, did you notice what the name, how that starts? Fluor? It's a fluoride-based wow. antibiotic. And these class of drugs not only disrupt the DNA of viruses, back to, or excuse me, bacteria, mm -hmm. you know, antibiotic. Um, All they, bacteria. They, they disrupt the DNA, period. In other words, they change your DNA. And this is one drug that has finally gotten a black box warning despite numerous people who've had experienced tremendous... I mean, some people are taking these antibiotics and, and not walking again and not being able to yeah, function a whole story in their jobs. In yeah. Yeah. So, um, I mean, and this might be worth it because I don't think I have enough time to read this whole girl's story. Might, if you feel like it, you might pop it in the newsletter. But Yeah, I, I probably will do that. But I want you to understand something, folks, that Many of these newer antibiotics are profitable for the drug companies because they are under patents or this kind of a thing. And some of the older antibiotics, should you decide you have a situation that requires an antibiotic, uh, I would certainly encourage you to just say, almost like you wear those bracelets that say medical alert, I do not want any antibiotic that's a fluoroquinolone. Okay? And um, 
And, you know, people go, well, how could this be? You know, isn't the FDA there to protect us? Well, we do know that these organizations, these government agencies, often receive 50% of their funding from the pharmaceutical industry, so it would be very hard for us to trust that their real focus is in protecting us. I mean, I think that's kind of clear, don't yeah, you? Yeah, and uh, also the pharmaceutical industry is big on uh, funding the education, so that's where the education kind of leads us to. You know? And I'm not saying that your doctor would in any case want to um, do anything that would harm you. They're exactly just kind of repeating what the cute girl in the little tight skirt came in and told them. When they gave them their I samples. Like that. But let, let me look at this holistically, Paige, uh -huh. because it's it's not just the problem with this. It's everything. Look at the state of the world today. Okay, uh -huh. we have all this fighting going on. We've got the this kind of cancer in the ISIS ISIL thing, uh -huh. and when we look at it on a holistic basis, the whole body of humanity is the Earth, and all of us are living on it. Uh -huh. And here we have these cancer cells all over the world. And, uh, yeah, we can go in there and bomb the crap out of them. Uh -huh. uh, we can send troops in there and get rid of them. But what is the underlying thing that's going on? Uh -huh. What's the instigator here? What's the, what's the inflammation? Let's, you know, get it down to what our body is doing to ourselves. Right. The inflammation is that we've been there for hundreds of years. And when I say we, I'm talking about the European mentality. Mm -hmm. of conquering people mm -hmm. and making them do because competition France competition versus collaboration yeah exactly always, it always comes back to that so the Britons and the uh, French and the United States have been there for hundreds of years agitating these people and of course they're going to fight backs mm -hmm. you know yeah they're maniacs over there but they didn't get that way I mean yeah maybe they've been that for 2,000 years because they've been invaded so many times but all we can do is work on ourselves. We're never going to solve that problem, and it, it's about our health, too. We have to do things ourselves, and we have to make sense of these things ourselves, and we have to deconstruct them and find out where that inflammation comes from. And that's what we from. do here. We're, and we're trying to encourage you to deconstruct the news and realize that health and healing empowerment comes from educating and employing decisions yourself, not because somebody told you this is the case. That's Look right. So shut words. off the TV, don't listen to those news, and start working on your things. You know, uh, have you, how, how has it been that we haven't spent probably uh, a couple of days a week even sitting alone, reading, uh, talking to our spouse, to our friends, and doing away with the TV and the newspapers and stuff, and living mm -hmm. locally mm -hmm. within our little community that we touch people? Because we're not touching those people over in those countries. I mean, if you want to do that, go over there and touch them. Mm -hmm. But we can't touch them from here, so we have to work locally, we have to work on ourselves. And the same with these problems with these drugs, is we have to work out, it out ourselves without the drugs. And there's many natural ways of doing that, and uh, it'll get you a lot farther, I believe. Looking at the food, it starts with that, no doubt about it. Mm -hmm. And it looks, and the next thing is your environment. Mm -hmm. So working on your food and your environment and the people that you love and that are around you and your neighbors and get to know them and start working out these problems individually and I think you're a lot better off than uh, listening to the news. But you can still listen to us, I think. Yeah. yeah. Well, so. well, you have to take your news from multiple sources and find yeah. the truth yourself. Yeah. 877-927-6648 if you'd like to give us a call. We have a great segment coming up. We're going to be talking a little bit about uh, our Primal Edge, which is coming up in a couple of weeks, folks. We put the order in, so it's coming our way. And pick up my Health Signals newsletter, and Paige and I will be right back. Has the current market volatility continue to stop you out of trades when the market spikes against you? Now is the perfect time to open up an account with Nadex. Nadex, the North American Derivatives Exchange, is a brand new, completely regulated Chicago-based exchange. And unlike most other exchanges, Nadex allows you to trade directly through them with direct market access when using their completely free trading platform, which also features real-time charts and full customization capability. One of the advantages of trading with Nadex in volatile markets is that your risk is always capped and you have the ability of keeping your trades open even when the market spikes against you. Nadex is completely brand new with a line of unique trading products that are unavailable anywhere else. See how it works at Nadex.com. That's N-A-D-E-X.com. 
or click on the Nadex banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Futures and options trading involves risk and may not be appropriate for all investors. If you're an active trader looking for that extra edge when it comes to trading and investments, then now is a great time to get a two-week free trial to Tom O'Brien's daily market letter, Market Insights. Tom O'Brien's daily newsletter, Market Insights, comes out every market day at around 9.30 a.m. and provides Tom's daily commentary on the broad market, including the Dow, NASDAQ, and S&P, plus specific trade recommendations. There's even an update published most afternoons to keep you informed about the day's market activity. He'll give you the entry price, price target, and stock price of each stock in option trade. With Market Insights, there's nothing left to guessing. For all the details and to get your two-week free trial to Market Insights started today, visit TFNN.com. The Path of Least Resistance is David White's daily trading newsletter, and if you're looking for active trading ideas, then now's a perfect time for a 30-day free trial to this powerful daily trading advisory service. David uses his years of trading experience to offer his subscribers his trading ideas each morning in his Path of Least Resistance newsletter. Using a combination of equity trades along with options, David keeps his subscribers up to date with all pertinent market information with intraday afternoon updates when warranted. Don't miss out on this great chance to get a 30-day free trial to David's daily newsletter, The Path of Least Resistance, with no obligation to pay anything. David has been delivering solid recommendations for his subscribers recently, and if you'd like to see the type of newsletter he delivers every morning, then visit the front page of TFNN, and you'll find The Path of Least Resistance under Trading Newsletters. For all the details, and to start your 30-day free trial today, log on to TFNN.com now. No matter where you listen to TFNN programming, we want you to know you can always access your favorite shows on demand through TFNN.com. TFNN airs live programming every market day from 8 a.m. till 6 p.m. Eastern. And you can view each program by accessing Tiger TV through our homepage. We even have an easy link for all mobile devices, including iPhones and iPads, located at the top right-hand corner of the TFNN homepage. You can use your smartphone to view Tiger TV. But if you don't have a mobile connection that can keep up with streaming live video, then you can simply visit TFNN.MOBI in the browser of your smartphone for live streaming audio of all of our programs. The mission of TFNN is to educate our audience directly and interactively through our interactive website and radio call and talk shows. TFNN is able to teach all levels of investors the technical skills needed to trade in today's marketplace. In order to get the best information possible, TFNN has assembled the most respected financial minds in the country to provide the most current news and comprehensive advice available. TFNN.com. Educating investors. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. This is Nico and Paige here on Living a Primal Lifestyle. We've been talking about, uh, of course, the pharmaceuticals and uh, drugs and how we're really trapped into this uh, modern way of thinking about uh, health uh, when there's another way. And, you know, th despite uh, even the best efforts for us to eat a balanced meal, our food sources no longer contain the vitamins, minerals, nutrients our body really needs to stay healthy and strong. Uh, vitamins and mineral deficiency take a serious toll on our health. And it's also a mistake to think that the vitamins and mineral supplements are going to be effective enough to bridge the gap. And there's a real reason. You know, why, did our, why uh, do our food sources lack these nutrients? It's because of the pesticides that you mentioned, the fertilization, the use of modern agriculture. All these practices really destroy everything that's in it. And that's the key thing. These yes. fertilizers and pesticides, guys, that are used in modern agriculture, destroy, destroy or severely stunt the microorganisms, you know? as above so below as inside outside microcosm macrocosm right. the microorganisms that are in the soil that produce the highly powerful humic and fulvic acids we call that the nature's miracle molecule, molecule. Yes. and we are so thrilled to bring this secret from mother nature into our formulation yeah on the teleprompter here you can see that uh, primordial time and 
Yeah, there's a picture here that I picked out from uh, this uh, artist, and it really just embodies what I think about it. And I, I used it in our... Uh, uh, on our label. On our label. Yeah, we chose that because, you know, at a time when you see no n no man, you know, no agriculture going on, uh, the microorgan the soil was a rich, you know, community. Yes. The soil itself was where life was. And these fulvic and humic acids that were created produced nutrients, minerals that are absorbable and usable by our bodies. And that is the key. We've got to have our nutritional supplementation in a cellular, ionic, cell-ready form. And we are big proponents of all of us eating correctly so that yeah. we can the most nutrition. But if it's not in our soil, folks, it's not going to help us. Yeah. And these uh, acids, these the fumic and the humic uh, acids, really work in the soil to bring the minerals into the plants and then into the animals mm -hmm. and then into us if we're eating that way. So it's really important uh, and we figured that this was probably the best way to bring about a great liquid supplement that would embody what we think is the essential all these essential vitamins and minerals that we need. Right, because you and I are s supporting a primal lifestyle and primal man lived in an environment before the soil was destroyed. Yeah. And let's talk about what some of the power is of fulvic and humic because you know how okay. this is really an important part of what I do uh, with people that have a, um, a desire to work with me in their own health and healing empowerment. They have to have a high survival instinct. Yes. Because I only want to work with people who have a high survival instinct. Yeah. How about that? Yeah, I like I'm that. that, that. Okay, so, uh, I'm almost 70. I'm still surviving, so I feel pretty good. And that's because you want to search and employ the things that are going to make a difference for yeah. you. But fulvic and humic, these are the sparks of life, folks. And, you know, when our soil, or when our food lacks nutrition, which we get in conventional food, and even some organics, folks, these fulvic and humics are not available in all organics, although no, there are some organic farmers that are that putting are, that in the soil. Because they realize this. Yeah. But it's really, um, despite our best efforts to eat a good diet, we can still become acidic. And really the first phase in my multi-phase health and healing empowerment program that I do, the first thing I tell my clients is I've got to help you get a balanced pH. You can't heal unless you sure. have voltage. Potential of hydrogen means voltage, the ability to produce energy. Yeah. We need to have good voltage. And, you know, the acidity is not just from the foods we eat. It's from the thoughts we think. So there is an emotional, spiritual component. And that's what it's I try to It's all tied together. In. You know, bad thoughts or unhealthy thoughts or fear, anger, anxiety are like little drips of acid into mm -hmm. our system. So we have to help neutralize that. But what the fulvic and the humic acids do is they create something we like to refer to as zeta potential. Uh, think of red blood cells on a, on a microscope. Many of them clump and they stack like coins, a mm -hmm. rouleau effect. There's no... Um, Synergy. electromagnetism mm -hmm. to, you know, propel each other. You know when you take a magnet and it goes like this? Right. Uh, so we want our cells to have that space in the, in, in the extrasystal fluid mm -hmm. to get the healing nutrients. So that's, we really want to have a charge. You hear Nico and I always telling you, go recharge, ground, right. do your earthing. Uh, we're helping you do that with this formula. And this is a very powerful formula. We are so excited yeah, to bring sure. this because, you know, I'm not saying that it's a one-shot thing, but, you know, if we could give everybody something that could make a huge difference and be a one-shot thing, we sure as heck, you know, pull well, this thing yeah, together it, with the help of our formulator. It's amazing because uh, when I started taking it, I noticed such a difference. And I was taking what I considered was probably some of the best, you know, uh, Mark Sisson's uh, uh -huh. master formula, uh -huh. which is praised as uh, some of the best nutrients uh, but it doesn't have the humic. He doesn't have the full of humic, you know. And, and it, um, it's not liquid, which I think is important. Liquid is the best mediums, particularly for all assimilation, but particularly minerals. So it takes one step out. Especially when they're in the ionic form. Exactly. In the tiny usable form. Yeah. So I want to, can I just finish that about the membrane yeah, potential? Because the ability to be, have an electrical charge is key. Healing is voltage. Right. And we need voltage to heal, and we need the right frequencies, and we can get those frequencies from our food. We can get it from sound. Mm -hmm. We can get it from light. We can get it from electromagnetism. And heat. We get it from information and thoughts. Exactly. Yeah. Heat, heat and light, these are all actually part of the same light force. Um, we can get it from smells and smoke, and there's so many different ways. 
But if we want to heal, you know, we can't get well unless we heal the cell. And to have good cellular membrane potential, we've got to have a healthy membrane that is able to vibrate and let good stuff in. We've talked about that repeatedly. Those of you who watch the show know what we're talking about. And we've got to have that charge so that the good nutrients can get in our cell, but at the same time so the toxins can get out. And so many people are, have the inability to detoxify today. And, you know, you can take uh, the most fabulous nutritional formula, but if you don't have the ability for your cell membrane to work and the, and the, and the information mm -hmm. to get in the cell and the information to get out of the cell, it's going to be really tough. To yeah, and, uh, and built into this whole thing are, mm -hmm. is the detox. Mm -hmm. And, you know, acidic wastes are normally produced. I mean, all of us that, you know, work out and have an active lifestyle, we produce active uh, acidic waste products as a function of metabolism, as a function of breathing, as a function of moving. Yes. One of the reasons so many athletes struggle with disease, uh, you know, is often they produce so many, they have such a high level of free radicals, and they're not offsetting those that's with right. antioxidants. And your ability to recover is hindered, uh, and that's one of the uh, main things that I look for is because I'm training on a daily basis. You know, five days a week I'm, I'm in uh, training with jiu-jitsu and fighting, and uh, I need to recover, and I need to recover f quickly. And this is the key difference. With full acumic acids, you are giving your cell that ability to that electrical potential so that mm. the membrane can function yep. now we know there's another step and we have a little bit of essential fatty acids but we, you know in reality you know how I feel. I want some additional essential fatty acids. Well, there acids are. You know, there. we're going to. I take additional uh, uh, the fat, uh, essential, essential fatty acids. Fatty acids. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll t I take uh, you know the protein shakes with the uh, grass-fed whey right. as, as uh, something that I use before my workout because I know that digests very quickly. And it cur and it produces the amino acid building blocks that allow you to produce what. Glutathione, right? And glutathione is our is our own natural antioxidant. So that's yeah. why I believe. And I, and I also great. put the, the beef gelatin in there mm -hmm. because I know that uh, almost. I mean, it just goes into my body so fast. Mm -hmm. And I also use uh, MCT oil because it doesn't take many steps to get that into my. In fact, it doesn't go through the digestive system. It just absorbs through the walls. Right. So uh, you know, the, and that's what we're building into this. Uh, we're building that same type of rhythmic. Uh, stuff in, mm -hmm. into it that, that is so important to keep us being active. Uh, we need to be detoxing. We need to get the right stuff in. We need to get the bad stuff out. And that's one of the reasons that we insisted on a formula uh, that, in, that included fulvic and humic acids uh, from the most potent source available on the planet. And the reason is that we want you to make sure that you can restore optimal membrane potential yeah. because this is crucial for our healing, for our proper natural detoxification. And although Nico and I were, you know, we just got off there talking a little bit about foods that we take, yes, these are all great and they provide great raw materials, yeah. but most likely these crucial uh, elements are not available. Um, because of, of the environment that we're in, yeah. and there's very small amounts of places. We got a nice message places. here from mm -hmm. Jay saying uh, liquid is the fastest way to get something into your system. Detox is so important. The judge gave me 30 days to detox with free room and board. What, what a guy. guy. Hey, that's pretty nice. <laughs> Where do you get that? There you go. Oh, yeah. He's a, being a comedian today, uh, Jay. Yeah, I like <laughs> we, like, we like having that, uh, that input. But, um, yeah, so, you know, Let's talk a little bit because what we're talking about is this inability to get the good stuff in and the inability to get the, good, the bad stuff out mm -hmm. creates a condition called chronic body acidity. And chronic body acidity is what is the breeding ground for dis-ease, for the body to be at unease. It puts stre stress on the body. It, it puts the stress on the body and we know that bacteria, fungus, molds, parasites, etc. can uh, they operate in a low oxygen acidic environment and are unable to thrive and strive in an alkaline rich, mineral rich, properly charged environment. So this is the key here folks. Um, and really our product is, is at the foundation of helping you achieve proper mineralization with every one of the minerals, every one of the amino acids, the vitamins, even essential fatty acids, etc., 
uh, so that you can start to make sure you're getting the essential nutrients in a form that can get in and out of the cell yeah. every day of your life and to create that pH balance. And we hope to have this available by September 1st. Mm -hmm. uh, I believe that's when we'll have it. Uh, we sh next week we should have the, our order page already up. Uh, and uh, we'll have the prices for you. I think uh, we're, we've got that pretty much nailed down. And uh, of course, if you uh, buy it as a one-time thing, it's going to be a little higher price. If you get on board and do it on a monthly ship basis, mm -hmm. you're going to get a month supply of it, uh, 32 ounces. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's a, it's a beautiful thing because, uh, like I said, I've been taking it now for three months, and uh, my wife and I both noticed the huge, huge difference immediately. Uh, we were already pretty healthy, so okay. we could take the full dose. You can start with a half dose even. Mm -hmm. uh, some people who are healthy but have some certain problems can double dose it. Mm -hmm. It gets a little more expensive, of course. But. And, we, it, you know, when I work with people, sometimes I have a little different protocol. Sometimes, um, you know... I like to suggest doing a, a loading dose for, you know, 60, 90 days right. where you actually increase and maybe take a little bit over what, what we have. These, um, you know, the bottom line is, is that we're not getting this kind of a nutrition in our food no matter how well we're trying to eat, guys. Yeah. And um, so we need to get them in. And I, I love Dr. Wallach. What do you say? You know, it's better to have expensive urine than... than die from well, a, a disease that is, that's caused by nutritional deficiency. I noticed guys, with this formula, Paige, I noticed with this formula you don't have the yellow pea. Because, well, you know, a lot of that was synthetic bees. That was the other thing. Oh, really? In our formula, we're using fully reduced forms, methylated forms. I, I think some of you might know that a lot of people, they, this is an interesting t statistic, 50 to 90 percent of people... tastes great, by the way. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, 50 percent of the people maybe as many as 90% have a problem methylating, and methylating is breaking nutritional products down into a form they can use. Right. So this is one of the reasons we get concerned when you don't have synergists and cofactors. And, you know, I am a premier research labs quantum reflux practitioner. Dr. Marshall, to me, is the most brilliant man and brings the most pure products. We needed to find something here that met my strict standards. Yeah. That it was would, tough would to find that, because yeah, the yeah, labs yeah. weren't cooperating. Mm -hmm. It's really hard to find because what they wanted to do was buy the product they were already making. They don't want to make their product mm -hmm. according to what you uh, wanted. Well, uh, and I just think this is great, and, and don't get me wrong, uh, I still in, in utilize in my formulas and myself too, Dr. Marshall's formula yes, for retaining yeah. pH. I mean, I right. love um, I love adding additional coral mi coral minerals, and I like mm -hmm. greens mix and wheatgrass and this kind of a thing. But we can get into that farther. But I want to tell you something about this, um, in, and maybe we can talk each week a little bit, you know, more. Can we talk next break? Let's cover some more on our product. Of course. Because people want to know what's going on. We can do whatever we want. You know, again, we mentioned that about organic farming really depletes these fulvic humic, or you know, which are the acids produced by soil microorganisms. Think of bacteria in your gut. Think of the soil as mm -hmm. our environment. Um, but there are now some de developed countries that no longer allow modern agriculture to to deplete the soil. And countries like France are really doing things to improve their soil. And I'm just really glad to see that. And one scientist, uh, Minister of Health in France, said, the present form of agriculture to which our biological agriculture is opposed leads to the ruin of soil and health and will eventually begin about the death of humanity. Think of the soil as your health, guys. Isn't it true? I think so. Mm -hmm. um, so the U.S. crops only contain a fraction of fulvic humic. So you got to supplement it, guys. This is the most important thing. As much as 80% less humic fulvic is available in today's soil, even our organic fruits and vegetables aren't getting it. Some guys are putting it in. We'll be back. we got to go to a break. We'll talk a little bit more. And, yes, it does taste great. Yeah, it tastes great. And it tastes that when you taste it, it feels like it's healing immediately. That's the thing I really like about it. So we'll be back in a couple of minutes. 877 927 Does the current market volatility continue to stop you out of trades when the market spikes against you? 
Now is the perfect time to open up an account with Nadex. Nadex, the North American Derivatives Exchange, is a brand new, completely regulated Chicago-based exchange. And unlike most other exchanges, Nadex allows you to trade directly through them with direct market access when using their completely free trading platform, which also features real-time charts and full customization capability. One of the advantages of trading with Nadex in volatile markets is that your risk is always capped and you have the ability of keeping your trades open Open, even when the market spikes against you. Nadex is completely brand new with a line of unique trading products that are unavailable anywhere else. See how it works at Nadex.com. That's N-A-D-E-X.com. Or click on the Nadex banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Futures and options trading involves risk and may not be appropriate for all investors. Tom O'Brien's weekly gold letter, The Gold Report, gives complete and concise coverage of the entire gold market. Inside, you'll get Tom's commentary on gold, the dollar, the rand, the bond, the XAU, the HUI, and detailed coverage of nearly 25 mining stocks. He'll give you the entry price, price target, and stock price of each stock trade. The Gold Report is a long-term newsletter where the focus is on building real wealth through the management of a successful portfolio of gold stocks. With a lifetime of knowledge and almost 12 years of writing his informative weekly newsletter, The Gold Report, Tom O'Brien can provide you with the important market information to help you make better trades in the gold market. Don't let the next bull run in gold pass you by. To get a month-long free trial to The Gold Report, an $85 value, visit the front page of TFNN.com today. David White's newsletter, The Technology Insider, is focused like a laser on finding the next big things in technology. If you had invested only $10,000 in Microsoft in 1986, you'd have been a millionaire by 2000. Disruptive technology like Microsoft's is the key to these massive long-term profits, and The Tech Insider is the vehicle from TFNN to capitalize on these opportunities. This is the go-to newsletter that identifies, monitors, and profits on mostly little-known cutting-edge companies with great long-term prospects. David's experience is as an inventor of Emmy-winning animation products for TV and Hollywood that propelled a company public. Match that with 14 years as a full-time trader, and he's uniquely qualified to guide you through the light-speed world of ever-evolving high-tech. If you're ready to ride the next big technology bull market for less than $40 per month, log on to TFNN.com and get your two-week free trial to the Technology Insider. Get in on the ground floor of the next big thing today. We're told to follow our passion and everything else will fall into place. I hope that's what each of you are doing each and every day. Hi, I'm Steve Rhodes, host of the Money Master Show at TFN.com, and my passion for technical analysis is what led me to the most fundamental discovery and pattern recognition, the Rhodes Momentum Indicator, market scanner and trading strategy, a set of tools that identify the momentum and the power of the trend, the likes of which have never been seen before for every market and every time frame. Yes, folks, the trend is your friend, unless you're on the other side. New to technical analysis? This is the place to start. And experienced traders take advantage of the trend like never before. Experience the power of the Rhodes Momentum Indicator each day, available to subscribers of my newsletter service, Mastering Probability. I guarantee your satisfaction for the next 30 days unconditionally, so there's no risk to you other than being on the wrong side of the trend. Mastering Probability, available on the homepage of TFNN.com. And folks, live with passion. Up next, the Diagnostics Trading Hour with Daryl Martin here on TFNN. Welcome back, folks. This is Nico and Paige on Living a Primal Lifestyle. We're talking a little bit about the Primal Edge. You know, Paige, one of the things I've always done with my vegetables, and I always, you know, buy organic vegetables, is I don't clean them like a maniac. Mm -hmm. And the reason being, like with carrots, I'll just scrub them real lightly. And my wife once indicated to me, she, you know, there's still some dirt in there. I says, I know. That's what I want. Yeah. Because the organic uh, vegetables have that little bit of dirt on it, and that's what I want in my body. So it's so important to, for people to realize that we're trying to sanitize this food uh -huh. when the soil is where the nutrients are. Completely. And think of your extracellular fluid, the fluid that your cells float in as the soil and the cells that oh, show. Nice so if you think of it. your, you know, your 
extracellular fluid is that way. So one of the things that we do as a first step to great health is we, we want to balance the pH. Now, as a marker I use, and we'll talk about this further when we get the product. I'll probably want you guys to do a pH challenge. Those of you that are using the product should be testing your pH, and we'll give more instruction yeah, on that. great idea. But what we're looking for to really determine whether or not we have a good reserve of minerals mm -hmm. is a first morning urine pH. If your urine pH is not between 6.4 and 7.0, you are most likely experiencing bone loss, you are acidic, mm -hmm. and you are letting your cells float in an acidic bath, which we've already discussed, that the, the environment for dis-ease is a extracellular fluid that does not have oxygen in it, and that's acidic as opposed to alkaline. So what do we do? What happens when our bodies can't neutralize the acid? Uh, we have several pathways to neutralize acid, mm -hmm. um, but when we provide the minerals, the body can, um, you know, can create a healing environment by, and we need to restore that soft tissue reserve of minerals. It takes a while. Yes. And with this product, along with some other nutritional products and, and superfoods that we that we recommend, can really help you get to a good pH where you have uh, proper electrical potential. Uh, but let me read to you a little bit. Um, the primary acidic waste from m metabolic activities is CO2. Now, keep in mind, there's a good balance between CO2 and oxygen. A lot of people think, oh, CO2 is bad. But believe it or not, you've got to have some of that, too, no the, the proper balance. Um, but um, CO2 is dissolved in our blood and it's carried to our lungs where there is an exchange with oxygen. We exhale the CO2 and thus we remove it from our body. We don't want to have too much of a buildup. Um, the problem begins when there is more acid than our bodies can naturally neutralize or eliminate. And it gets bigger when those acids build up. And this can cause cell and tissue damage, which creates even more acids. And then what happens is the body can't deal with these acids. And the problem becomes overwhelming because these environments encourage the growth of bacteria, virus, fungus, and mold. And these invading pathogens uh, kind of thrive in this acidic environment. And we often see uh, to protect, our bodies are brilliant, we'll decide to uh, create some additional fat storage, primarily the, the, the waist, the thighs, and the buttocks are a place where we put a lot of extra fat to store these toxins to get them away from, from and that's our... that's really your fat cells are the storage uh, uh, modules of uh, toxins. Mm -hmm. And that's why people, when they start detoxing, they may not feel great, mm -hmm. and some of them even feel horrible. So when we don't have a place to store these, the body says, look, I, and you've heard me talk about when we don't have, when we have, your body's going to use all the minerals we've got. So if there are no soft tissue stores of these alkalizing minerals, our body's going to say, I need some minerals. Where are some? There are some in the bone, right? Yep. It's going to start dissolving the bone. Uh, one place you can see it is in the jaw. Mm -hmm. You know, you can start to see it. Uh, yep. You know, we have these tests, certain places in the heel, in the hip, where we can start to see The important loss. thing to remember, folks, is never too late. We've all been toxic at one point or another. I know I've been trying to be healthy a long time, but uh, now I'm much healthier than I, I ever was, so it's never too late. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, that's all the time we have. We'll be discussing this a little bit more, and by next week we should have some prices for you, and uh, we'll go from there. So I appreciate you sticking around, folks. I uh, hope you have a happy Friday and a great weekend, and a couple weeks. We'll have Labor Day coming up. And, That's right. Uh, yeah. Have a great weekend, guys. Be healthy. Take care. Good night. Since 1984, Basil Chapman has been using the Chapman Wave methodology to advise traders of his expert market opinion. While originally hand-drawing charts from the late 1970s into the 1980s, Basil noticed that prices under most circumstances virtually always had a certain number of legs to the upside before declining sharply. Later, Basil found that computer software, which included the standard market technical indicators, enhanced the degree of accuracy in calling price turns, as well as market trend calls. Thus was born the Chapman Wave sequence. Using the Chapman Wave methodology along with other indicators, Basil Chapman advises his subscribers of his expert market opinion each market day with his opening call newsletter. Right now you can get a two-week free trial to the opening call, Basil's daily trading newsletter, by visiting the front page of TFNN.com. Cancel at any time during that trial and pay absolutely nothing. Get your two-week free trial to Basil's newsletter, the opening call, today by visiting TFNN.com. You're watching Tiger TV.